let's talk about free homes. So this home was a home that was in the family for pretty much the entire time that this thing has been sitting here. And huge double wide. I'd say it's probably, we're probably looking around 1900 square foot. Mom passed away. Brother let sister live into, move into it and live in it. And she became a hoarder. <laughs> so what ended up happening is we've got tons of overgrowth. So the park was in transition while she was in there. And so there is tons of overgrowth, um, lack of maintenance on the home. The entire home floor to ceiling was just loaded in garbage. Three years without water being on in the home. And so there was bags of squishy stuff. Yeah, not gonna get into details on that uh, throughout the home. But we have a lot of interesting things such as broken windows, fascia fixes, and things like that through the home. If it was smell-o-vision, you'd be able to smell it. But floor to ceiling, disgusting bathroom, disgusting bedroom, but the overall bones are pretty amazing in the home. Huge, huge bedrooms. I mean, this is the master. As you can see, just the slime on the walls. Um, what we're gonna do is, they're gonna do a clean with power wash and rag, and then they're gonna mud mud it so it doesn't come through. And then we're gonna use a colored um, paint, probably like a, like a gray, like a light gray. And as you can see, there's, there's just different levels and degrees of disgusting. It was uh, more disgusting. These tubs have a tendency to fail. Um, the biggest, weakest spot is right around that drain. Obviously disgusting, disgusting. Um, I, am, I almost fell on my rear end in here because of slip sliding away. Uh, the thing that's kind of crazy is water heater isn't looking too bad, probably because she didn't use it. And this is probably one of the cleanest heaters I've seen in a long, long time. But we've got a lot of um, touch-ups, fix-up, clean-ups to do. But overall, I mean, this home, considering its roof is all curled, all the shingles are cur curled, we do have a little bit of decking that needs to be repaired, but we're not seeing watermarks coming in which is a huge, huge godsend. Marriage line is fine. So it's just a matter of cleaning up and freshening up and putting this thing back on the market. And then in this area, they appraise for a heck of a lot better. And that's us having a plan with our one of our contractors. So you can get free homes in 2024. Uh, it's just a matter of being able to talk to the right people. The situation was is the brother just wanted to be done with it, kicked the sister out, and we have actually two homes for zero dollars. So it's just a matter of putting it back together. There's going to be money definitely involved with that, but um, just wanted to share you a different experience with you and how you can get ones for no money down. Make it a great day.